paying a springtime visit to Frampton Marsh today in the fields just off the car park there's a little egret it's a mixture of sun and cloud today and quite breezy it's around about quarter to nine in the morning there's quite a few people here already it's got a large skein of brent geese in the air they should be off to their breeding ground soon here's the first of the two hides we're going to check out today see what i can see from here as you can hear on the soundtrack it's mainly black-headed gulls that are out there but there is a red shank and also a rough there and also uh, of course a tufted duck and so a few mute swan on view this is the view from the opposite side of the hide looks in the opposite direction also got black-headed gulls on view from here also avocet hopefully get a better view of those from the next side down and there's also quite a large group of uh, Godwit there. Okay, moving on to the 360 degree hide. No sign of San Martins in the bank there yet. It's quite cloudy, uh, but the sun does break through and blue sky appears. This is the view you get from the 360 degree hide. And uh, yet more Brent geese. Officially, uh, they come to the UK between October and leave again in March, but. Uh, large groups still and I think a few non-breeding birds may stay but uh, they should be off to their breeding grounds pretty soon and also as I said good views much better views of Avocet from uh, this side distinctive sweeping motion of the bill there as it feeds Got a pair of gadwall out there preening and lots of these birds uh, shell duck the male birds or drakes can get pretty uh, aggressive this time of year trying to hold on to their females. Good views of uh, rough from here too. Rough vary so much in their markings. I haven't seen any males with uh, their roughs yet, their breeding roughs, but it's probably a little bit early yet. And the rough actually has a red status for the RSPB. Just in the middle of the black-headed gulls there, there's a little gull feeding. That's the first one of those I've seen this year. Another red shank feeding with the Avocet. Some more black-tailed godwit. And this is nice, it's a little ring plover. Identified by the yellow ring around its eye. Also ring plovers on view. Uh, no ring around the eye and uh, orange beak. And just a little bit bigger. I didn't realise, but uh, according to the RSPB, little ring plovers have a green status, and ring plovers has, have a red status. So obviously they're rarer and declining. So it's lovely to see them. Okay, time we were making our way back to the car park. Have a look, see what uh, we can see on the way. Just passing the reed beds now. You can hear sedge warblers in there, but uh, can't see them, they're too well hidden. Just outside the visitor centre on the feeders, a couple of uh, nice goldfinches on view in the fields, uh, just adjacent to the car park, Lapwing. That's it, I'll see you next time.